Well, hey everybody, it's Gersh Kunstman of the Brooklyn Paper. Walk with me as we go on the ultimate wild goose chase. That's right, we're in Prospect Park to addle some goose eggs to see if we can find some eggs and you mainly addle them so that they will not grow up into the next generation of geese to be slaughtered here in Prospect Park in the name of aviation security. So we're going to go check them out right now. Join us as we go addle some eggs. Now I know a thing or two about egg addling from my extensive coverage of last year's goose massacre and the humane efforts to avoid such an event this summer. But before you can conduct any research in the field, it's best to don the appropriate attire, as you see me doing here with my hip waders. Now you can see I'm walking a little funny because I'm completely suited up here for goose egg addling. Uh, one of the biologists is going to fend off the goose. The males are much more feisty, apparently, while another one puts oil on the eggs to prevent its development. Let's see how this goes down. I know, I look like a million bucks, right? While we're walking, it's probably best if I explain what egg addling is. Basically, geese lay eggs, and if left undisturbed, the majority of those eggs will become geese. But Mayor Bloomberg hates geese because on rare occasions they fly into airplanes. So last year, the mayor ordered the massacre of 300 geese in Prospect Park. To avoid a reoccurrence of that, the Prospect Park Alliance, working with the Humane Society, is putting regular corn oil on developing eggs to prevent them from hatching into airplane-threatening waterfowl. We were invited along to watch. I don't know if you're seeing this, I'm actually going through the water in my hip waders to the nest. Now Martin Weiss of the Parks Department is leading this operation, while John Jordan will be in charge of fending off the geese. And this is not an unimportant job, because they tend to freak out when their nests are approached. Now Weiss's job is to inspect the nest to see if there are any new eggs. I had been briefed on this process, but nothing could have prepared me for the anger of this mated pair of fowl. The female is already squawking away, and here comes the male swooping in like a raptor to protect his young. Okay, there goes Jordan with that most scientific of implements, the $3 umbrella, to protect his colleague. But I tell you, this male will not be denied. Check him out as he pummels away at Jordan. This is exciting action you won't see anywhere else. Hold on a second, let's see that in super slow-mo Brooklyn paper cam. Oh, doctor! Well, eventually that gander calmed himself down, allowing Weiss to do his job. He found the nest and discovered six eggs, all of which he'd addled on a previous visit. There's six milked eggs, which means I, I've already been here at one stage or another. All right, we call this a retreat. We call this a goose retreat. We have done our business. Here. We are moving off, and I gotta say, mission accomplished. And I don't mean that in the George Bush sense, I mean that actually in the actual sense. Mission accomplished. That was some heroic fending. <laughs> Any techniques you want to give the reader, the viewer at home? Uh, no, just be very careful. I feel bad for them. I mean, they're upset. Well, that's all from Prospect Park. We didn't get a chance to actually addle any eggs, but we did get to see some of the heroic, humane work being done by some of the biologists here. It's a sad day for me because now I've got to take off these gorgeous hip waders, but everything comes to an end. I'm Gersh Guzman of the Brooklyn Paper. Let's see.